The Akron Police Department wanted to do something special to honor the lives lost from 9-11. Sophia Lesios gives us a look at the memorial services from earlier today. With 9-11's 20th anniversary, Yakima Police Department and Fire Department partnered up to honor those that lost their lives on 9-11. Take a look. Tuesday, 9.47 a.m. Hi, baby. I'm, baby, you have to listen to me carefully. I'm on a plane that's been hijacked. I'm on the plane. I'm calling from the plane. I want to tell you I love you. Please tell my children that I love them very much. And I'm so sorry, baby. Hope to be able to see your face again, baby. I love you. Bye. This year marks the 20th anniversary of an event that changed American history. 9-11 is one of the most tragic historical events people still remember to this day. And Yakima Police Department and Fire Department wanted to have a memorial service. There were thousands of police and firefighters at the World Trade Center on September 11, 2001. And we all know that 414 lost their lives that day. Many others have suffered from toxic exposure. Even after 20 years, these police officers and firefighters are losing their lives. I spoke with Yakima Fire Department's chief about his memories that day. Well, it kind of just brings things to home knowing how dangerous our job is and, you know, that that could happen, you know, to anybody you know, in this profession. When we talked about his visit to the memorial site in New York years after the tragic event, he got emotional thinking about what had happened. And we were able to see ground zero in the pools that were that were built. And being a, uh, sorry, and being a small town kid, you know, and you know, these buildings around here in Yakima are, um, are nothing compared to, I've never been to New York City. And when you stand there, in a pool that's about the size of an acre and look up to buildings that are 100 stories tall. I mean, it just, it is amazing um, to just see what had happened. In Yakima for NBC Right Now, I'm Sophia Lesios.